Good morning, folks. Today we're looking at sunspots, seeing plasma penetrate our shield into the atmosphere again. The earthquake uptick continues. We've got a sinkhole, the U.S. climate update for May, and an announcement about the next public event for the Mobile Observatory Project, Albuquerque, one month from today. But first, let's come to spaceweathernews.com and reveal a relatively calm last day on our star, but with some things to keep an eye on. Solar flaring remains low with only little blips coming from the sunspot group born two days ago and now departing. We have beta polarity with modest mixing opportunities, worth watching today as it turns towards the limb. The solar wind at Earth is extremely dense. The particle intensity isn't great on an individual basis, but the stream itself is a bit much to handle, and rather than driving geomagnetic instability, it has offered us another day of plasma penetrating into the upper atmosphere, multiple absorption lines showing it on the rheometers. Coronal holes here, dark, facing Earth, and the earthquake uptick continues. This one hits Indonesia again up into 6 range. We've got video here out of Ottawa. A large sinkhole has opened up right in the middle of the city, and apparently the parking violations in Canada have gotten much more severe. Come on, man, I was only in there like five minutes. I already started writing the ticket, I'm sorry. Moving to climate where the temperatures at night didn't drop so low in May, but they didn't jump so high in the daytime either. All in all, a mixed bag with definitively increased precipitation levels. That desert rain is pre-monsoon season. As I mentioned at the start, on July 9th, one month from today, the Mobile Observatory will have its first event since our move to Albuquerque. Residents of New Mexico and anyone who feels like driving in for a brunch and hangout on July 9th needs to email cat at observatoryproject.com for details and to let us know you're coming. Also, we'll have details coming up at our websites. But also be sure to check out thunderbolts.info to check out the conference less than 10 days away in Phoenix. Still time to get your tickets or live stream for the event. We've got pressure and radar forecast followed by shots of our star to close. It's 4 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.